Hey guys, how are you doing? And in this episode, we are going to see why Apple India users are facing the following error when they try to add their credit and debit card to their Apple ID payment settings. This card type is no longer supported. Remove this payment method and then add a new one. Also, I'm going to share some news about the possible cashback that you can claim while adding funds to your Apple ID. As per the latest RBA norms, you know, credit and debit cards should follow the e-mandates where the online service providers, whenever they collect your credit and debit card for any subscription renewal, they have to notify you prior to the subscription renewal that they are going to charge your card or bank account. Subscription services like YouTube and Netflix have already implemented the latest RBA mandate and uh, Apple India is still, you know, lagging behind and they seem to be working on it and for the past one week users are facing issue with adding their credit and debit card recently i have published a video about how to add funds to your apple id if your credit or debit card is not working with your iphone and ipad you can use phone pay or amazon application to you know get the apple store gift card and then you can add funds to your apple id Additionally, if you are looking for some cashback option, you can use a Paytm application to generate your App Store code. The complete step-by-step -step process of how to create the App Store code and how to apply it and add funds to your Apple ID is the tutorial that I have uh, published in the last episode. I'll leave a link to that in the description as well as in the first comment. You can click and see, you know, if you're a first-time iPhone user and you need a complete walkthrough, you can check that tutorial. Here you can see in the Paytm, they are providing 3% flat cashback and also 100% cashback for some users like based on some random you know winner selection they are also giving 100 percent cash back but three percent is guaranteed that's what we can understand from that and you can add funds to your apple id to use it for purchasing applications or you know renewing the subscription of your icloud or apple music or any other application this is the only workaround that we have right now your credit and debit card will not work you know irrespective of your visa or mastercard or you know whichever the card you own the apple id system is currently going through some sort of maintenance and i think it may take like another couple of months or you know little before that that apple finally follows the rba mandate uh, procedure so till that time you can add add like two or three months advance balance to your Apple ID, you know, to add funds to your Apple ID for any iCloud subscription or Apple Music or any other apps subscription renewals. So that is all. And if you find this video useful, don't forget to share it with your friends. People who have similar problem may be able to find a solution. Thank you and have a wonderful day.